Hi Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for all your likes, shares, and subscribes. For a personal reading, please visit my website. All the information is in the description box below. Spirit messages please for Scorpio for July 2022, please. July 2022. Something about responsibility, okay, or releasing some type of responsibility here, Scorpio. Spirit messages please for July 2022. Mm -hmm. Wow, okay, this is a lot, but it's okay. So we have first breath, beginning, beginner's mind. So I feel like something may have been challenging going into July, and I feel like a lot of balancing is going on here, okay? I feel like also I'm hearing the stars are aligning for you, Scorpio. There is a transition, a change that is happening, okay? But the stars are aligning for you, okay? I feel like also a um, new mindset, um, new beginnings, expansion, okay? Because they're showing me like Jupiter. So I feel like something is going to start expanding for you. I feel like good news or something about a new arrival here, okay? We have fallen angel. So I feel like something had to, it's almost like something had to be let go of. Now, <clears throat> also with this falling angel, there may have been some um, one that you lost in the past, okay, that is actually coming in to help you, giving you strength, giving you something here, okay? I feel like a gift, okay? Um, I feel like I'm picking up a loss of something during that time. So I feel like um, so this is something beforehand for some of you. But um, when I see this falling angel, it's almost like something may have been lost, okay? But I feel like there is um, some, there, I feel like spirit is gifting something to you here. I feel like um, also, I don't, I hear, okay, for some of you, I hear a job opening. That's what I heard clear as day. I heard job opening. I feel like something is coming to fruition. I feel like something is faded for you here, Scorpio, okay? I feel like a opening, a door, something is opening, okay? I feel like because you have let go of something, there is new beginnings, a new start, a transformation, a spiritual transformation here, okay? We have to... Um, two tens that 19 is a 10 right that one nine so we have deep um deep diver diving into a task okay so something new is here i feel like and you're going straight forward for this i feel like a lot of support um i feel like generosity and charity okay i see a lot of um recognition and reward that's coming towards you a lot of success okay <clears throat> we have the wall so you may have to go through some obstacles, as I was saying before, okay? And this was challenging for you, but as this wall, there is an opening here, if you can see. It looks almost like a keyhole to me, but I feel like there is something that is starting to open up for you, okay? Again, you may be going through something going into July, but that is starting to shift now, okay? <clears throat> We have Moon Maiden, New Beginnings. You started out with the beginner's mind, taking that risk, okay? The first step, again, I keep picking up expansion here, okay? And with that Moon Maiden, I feel like things are starting to expand, open up for you here, okay? Because you dive deep right into something and you let something go, okay? I feel like a deep release, okay? We have the crossing initiation. So as I said, that look at this. Well, look at that. I feel like you're crossing into a new portal or you're walking into something. The planets are aligning for you now, Scorpio. <clears throat> and I feel like even though you felt like something was not opening up for you or you could not see your way clearly, Scorpio, you are going to start walking down a new path. And that path is opening up doors for you, okay? And it's like, as you walk through there, look at the moon mate and new beginnings. That is a new beginning, okay? But you're going to start walking down a new path here. <clears throat> Stars in the sky, limitless possibilities, okay? So that bridge is bringing you into something new. And you're being divinely guided to this newness here, okay? What else, Spirit, please, for Scorpio? 
messages, please, Spirit, for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. Ooh, okay, Scorpio. We got a couple things going on. <clears throat> we have the talisman. You are destined to succeed. Okay, so no matter what, Scorpio, you are going to succeed. You are going to have the success. We have love, true love and fidelity. So I feel like things are like there's a lot of doors opening up for you here, Scorpio. I feel like you need to get ready because even though you may have been going through a lot of turmoil, you may have had issues in your family, issues with um, uh, jobs, issues with um, discord just within your mindset that is starting to shift now for you. OK, we have choose your words carefully. OK, so because of maybe the way that you have been hurt, um, there may be things that you, I, I feel like spirit is saying, listen, don't just hear the words of what someone is saying. Listen to what someone is saying before you speak. Gain the clarity first and then take it in and then respond. Don't react. OK, we have seduction, passion and romance awaits. So there may be a new love that's coming into your life here. Okay. We also have imagination clouds your judgments. Like I said, Scorpio, before you react, think, listen first. I'm sorry. And then as you listen, don't hear, don't hear, only hear what the person is saying. Listen, gain the clarity first, then Respond, not react. Okay. It says a close friend acts on your behalf. Okay. So someone is very guarded and protecting you on it at this time. Okay. And it says the stars, a long journey begins with rewards. There is great opportunity. The stars are aligning just for you. Something is coming in just for you here, Scorpio. Okay. Things are starting to be removed. Okay. Spirit, what else, please? For Scorpio. We have Yang. Proactively expression, doing, and forward movement. Things are starting to move in your favor. The sun is there. You're going to be so happy. Success is on the horizon. Nothing is going to be able to stop this because this is divinely guided. We have at the house 12, Pisces. Okay, so inner peace connections, spiritually karma, um, sacrificial service and healing. So there's going to be a lot of healing towards your love life for a lot of you. And also just your mindset. I feel childhood issues also. One more spirit. <clears throat> Oh, okay, well, I guess more than one. <laughs> All right. So we have um, imbalance, a point of tension, and a power struggle. So like I said, also with this, choose your words wisely and carefully, okay? So I feel like because of this transition or because of what is about to t um, transpire in your life, spirit is saying, don't react, okay? We have house six and establishing a foundation, health, daily life, and practical details. So with this, this is Virgo, and this is about your uh, self-improving yourself, your health. Um, for some of you, you could be focusing more on yourself, okay? Also, your environment, habits, things that you normally do, okay? I feel like there's going to be a change in your routine here, okay? Spirit, what else, please? <clears throat> What else? Ooh, okay. That's a lot. Okay. Well, we'll take what's in the middle. All right. So we have the emperor. So you could be dealing with an Aries um, or a Taurus, I'm hearing. Um, so I feel like with this leadership, taking taking the something about leadership, taking the reins, going with the flow, okay, um, 
a lot of authority and also stability protection here we have the six of pentacles so with the six of pentacles like i talked about generosity being kind but not only to others but to yourself there is also support that's coming in okay we have the all gifted okay so i feel like spirit is guiding you and helping you and gifting something to you okay i feel like equal give and take also transformation and change i feel like the eight of cups you're walking away from something that was really bothering you or hindering you and i feel like you're walking more into something that's more light we also have the eight of swords there was a lot of frustration aggravation so i feel like you're trying to get away from all of those things the four of swords you're trying to find some rest some recuperation within july <clears throat> Okay, and we also have the Ten of Swords. I feel like this is that transformation. Spirit is pulling you out. Look at that. You're being pulled out of a situation. You're being pulled out of something, okay, that was really hindering you. Um, th there may have been um, abuse of power. Someone was a, um, trying to hold something over you that is no longer here okay and there is great change that is happening for you scorpio you are becoming very enlightened to make this change or for this change to come towards you whatever obstacle that was in your way is being removed look at that completion the world okay accomplishment a sense of belonging Okay, a lot of insight is coming through for you here. We have the Nine of Swords. There may be some anxiety, some stress due to these changes that's happening around you, but you are coming out of it, okay? Um, there may have been, um, I, I really feel like a lot of anxiety. Now, there may be a little fear because of the new, okay? But Spirit is saying, listen. Okay. This is what you have manifested, Scorpio. You've asked for this. And now it's your turn. Okay? So thank you so much, Scorpio. Please like and subscribe. And I will speak to you soon. Bye-bye.